Alyssa, I knew you were the one the first day we met. So sure that I told you that you were gonna be my girlfriend that exact night. Your love and kindness light up every room and every person you touch. I have never known anyone who cares so deeply for everyone that they love. And you constantly make me a better man. All kidding aside, I'm so lucky to be able to go through life with you. I promise and vow to always love you faithfully and honorably for the rest of our lives. I truly knew I was in good hands about eight months into our relationship when we got COVID and I had to spend two weeks straight together. Even though you kept telling me to just suck it up and how it wasn't that bad, even though I felt like I got hit by a school bus, our relationship strengthened and we got through it. I knew I had also found a great family the first time I went to the lake house in 2020 and was immediately welcomed in like family. Thanks, Connor. And I even passed Lily's infamous boyfriend test for Alyssa as if that was ever going to be an issue. All kidding aside, I'm so lucky to be able to go through life with you. I promise it, and I cannot wait to start this next chapter in our journey together. You look so good, babe. Thank you. You need to. Suit looks good. Yeah, that's good. You look good. Zachary, here we are, 1,712 days later. I never would have thought over a long distance Snapchat friendship would have turned into something so magical. The first day we actually met, even though we probably crossed paths numerous times playing soccer together, I knew we had something special. I never felt this way about anyone. However, I sure was thinking how I would tell my parents and brothers that technically Matt McCarthy was the one who introduced us. Their reaction was interesting to say the least, and then they met you and most importantly, realized why I fell in love with you. I will always dream with you, celebrate with you, and walk by your side in whatever God has planned for us. I promise to be your ally in conflict and your greatest fan and toughest adversary. I see these vows as more than promises, but also as privileges that I am the one God chose for you and you are the one God handpicked for me. Lastly, I vow to you perfect love and perfect trust, although may not always be defined as perfect. These are my sacred vows to you, my equal in all things. By the power vested in me, by the great free state of Florida, husband and wife, Zach, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great pleasure to present to you, for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Zach Hall. <laughs> Alyssa, from the moment you came into this world, you showed us that you were tough, but oh so sweet. You know how to hold your own, never backing down from a challenge, yet you proceed with a heart full of compassion and kindness. From the moment Allison and I met him, we knew there was something special about this young man. As a talented college soccer player himself, it was fun to watch Alyssa and Zach bond over their love for the game. Having fun together at the lake and the beach 
all, all the time making family and God the priorities in their lives. Zach's unwavering support for Alyssa and his love for her were evident from the start. Zach, you have proven yourself to be the perfect match for our daughter, and we couldn't be happier to welcome you with our family. Together, Alyssa and Zach, you are a force to be reckoned with. Your love and dedication to one another are truly inspiring. And I have no doubt that you will conquer any challenges that come your way. Just memory